Vaccination efforts moved into the heart of downtown Fort Worth earlier today. Sundance Square now part of the new vaccine strategy of basically putting shots in places with a lot of people. However, people haven't entirely returned to the square yet. Our Jason Allen is there, though. He's one of a few in Fort Worth to explain for us tonight what's going on. Jason. Yeah, Doug, I talked to a county commissioner today who referred to this still as the crossroads of Fort Worth. And you can't cross through it still. You just can't gather in it like you could pre-pandemic. It is still roped off and still blocked off as we head into summer. After months delivering shots in parking lots, stadiums, group homes, and lately schools, public health made doses available from a downtown Fort Worth pavilion Friday. Opening up in Sundance Square is part of an idea to offer vaccinations in places where people are already gathering. We called it Fort Worth's living room. And that metaphor is very appropriate for where we are in the vaccination place. The living room, though, is not the gathering place it was before the pandemic. While the rest of the state has opened up, outdoors and indoors, Sundance Square remains closed. Ropes keep people from wandering in off the sidewalk. Trees and shrubs were brought in to block anyone from the open spaces. Restaurants on either side have closed. We're being very careful about the health of our community and we want to be as safe as possible. And we took a lot of uh, care in um, creating the environment uh, and putting stuff together. And that's kind of one of our main considerations. Zach Murphy told us there are plans to open up the square in the near future. There's no date though. Another spokesman for the square told us it would be soon. County Commissioner Roy Charles Brooks told us he still thought vaccine efforts would be successful, even without a decision to open the square to people. That is not my decision to make, but I am looking forward to seeing this square once again crowded with people. I checked with them just a few minutes ago. They did 51 doses today. Uh, they plan to keep coming out here, Doug, and whether they do more or less than that, they're going to do this every Friday for the next six weeks, right up until the 4th of July. All right, good news. Jason Allen, thank you very much.